Hi, today we'll be talking about Aziz Sanjar. Aziz Sanjar is an American Turkish biochemist who discovered how cells repair UV damage. Aziz Sanjar was jointly awarded the Nobel Prize for Chemistry in 2015. He is best known for his groundbreaking discovery on the mechanisms used by bacteria in humans to find, remove, and repair UV and chemically damaged DNA. We explore the life and times of Sanjar and his award-winning work. Aziz Sanjar was born on the 8th of September in 1946 in Suvar, Mardin province. The Nobel Prize, and I quote, says, Aziz Sanjar was born in Suvar in southeast Turkey in a lower middle class family. His parents had no education but considered education important for their children. He is best known as the biochemist who discovered a cellular process known as nucleotide excision repair. This is the process where cells correct errors in the, their DNA that arise from damage caused by exposure to UV of certain mutation inducing chemicals. As a result of this groundbreaking work, Aziz received the 2015 Nobel Prize for Chemistry. He shared the prize with two other biochemists, Thomas Lindahl and Paul Modric. His work encompasses various subfields. These include but are not limited to biochemistry, molecular biology, DNA repair, molecular biophysics, cancer research. As already mentioned, Aziz's primary work has been on DNA repair but he also made significant contributions to photolase and nucleotide excision repair in bacteria that have changed the field. At this time, Aziz Sanjar is the Sarah Graham Kennan Professor of Biochemistry and Biophysics at the University of North Carolina School of Medicine. He's also a member of the UNC Lineberger Comprehensive Cancer Center. Aziz Sanjar initially trained as an MD in 1969 at the Istanbul Medical School. After qualifying, he worked as a local physician near his hometown of Savur. In 1973, Aziz went to the United States to study molecular biology at the University of Texas in Dallas. He completed his PhD at the university and was then offered a position as a research associate at Yale University. In 1982, Aziz joined the faculty at the University of North Carolina School of Medicine. It was there that he was later named the Sarah Graham Keenan Professor of Biochemistry and Biophysics. To get a better understanding of Aziz Sanjar's Nobel Prize winning work, let's listen to what the Nobel Prize has to say. And I quote, Living cells have DNA molecules that carry an organism's genes. For the organism to live and develop, its DNA cannot change. DNA molecules are not completely stable, and they can be damaged. In 1983, through studies of bacteria, Aziz Sanjar showed how certain protein molecules and repair enzymes repair DNA damaged by ultraviolet light, or UV. These discoveries have increased our understanding of how the living cell works the causes of cancer, and aging processes. Going back to Aziz Sanjar, as a graduate student at the University of Texas, he studied an enzyme called photolase in E. coli at this time. The enzyme had recently been discovered to mediate the process of photoreactivation. This is where visible light induces enzymes to repair damaged DNA after being damaged by UV irritation. Later on, he would continue his research at Yale University.